let's just say a farm boy from, well, Cape Breton, Nova Scotia. He might feel that he should do something different than his daddy did. Farming, fishing, coal mining. You know what I mean. Not that he's not proud of his daddy, but the big city has a way of luring the country boy. He wouldn't be there all too long before he'd get himself a pretty good job. You know what I mean. Factory somewhere. Might even work himself up to be foreman someday. You can never tell. But that still don't help his loneliness. See, a man like that needs a good woman. Oh, he'd find himself a woman pretty quick, all right. Some city girls like the way a country boy treats him. They'd get themselves an apartment, you know, 25th floor, apartment 2505. You know what kind of mean. They'd live real well there for quite some time. He'd be bringing home the good bucks. Wouldn't be a year, maybe, he'd be coming home from a couple hours overtime. He'd be making that long, anxious walk down that short corridor. He'd go in that door, and then he'd see it. That note, you know the kind of note I mean. Dear John, I'm gone. A man like that had his whole world fall right down in front of his face. He'd find himself at four o'clock in the morning down at the nearest railroad station. He don't really care where he goes. He don't really want to go home to Cape Breton yet because something about country boys, they don't like to go home with failure. You know what I mean. Gonna take a freight train down at the station, Lord. I don't care where it goes. Gonna climb a mountain, the highest mountain, Lord. I might jump right off, and nobody gonna know. 